So the pies is probably the thing that's going to take the longest. So I would put these in first. Now all you need to do is take them out of the packaging. They're ready to go. So they go into a 175 degree oven for about, I would say 30 to 35 or 40 minutes. Like it really all depends on your oven and that's it. So all you have to do is put them onto a roasting tray. A piece of baking paper isn't totally necessary, but if you have it, it's good because it just makes clean up a little bit easier. Try and space them out and then olive oil drizzled over the top and a sprinkle of salt and some black pepper. And then that just goes into a 175 degree oven for about 20 or so minutes until it gets brown and golden. So for the radicchio salad, um, you just need a mixing bowl here and um, a microplane if you have one, which is one of these guys. Um, but if you don't, you can also just chop this um, little hard boiled egg to go onto the salad. So inside this container, you've got your red wine and lemon vinaigrette, as well as some crunchy toasty breadcrumbs. Um, so the salad leaves just go into the mixing bowl here. And then onto the salad would go the dressing. And you always just want to give that a little pinch of salt. And then into your salad bowl here. Then breadcrumbs on, sprinkle all of that all throughout, and then using that microplane, that's how we are going to get the egg onto the salad. And it should just create kind of this like fine sort of sprinkle of the egg over everything. And then we'll finish off with some black pepper. So to prepare our butternut squash soup, literally could not be easier. And if you have a microwave, you could absolutely heat up your soup in the microwave. Just pour it all into a small little pot. And then I'm gonna put it on the stove over like a kind of medium flame. Um, and as it starts to simmer, I'm just gonna stir it to make sure that it heats up evenly. So once the soup is hot, steaming hot, just divide it into some bowls that you like. And then you've got this delicious, crunchy little hazelnut and sage sort of garnish. So I just like to break that up and serve that on top of each soup. And that is it for the butternut pumpkin soup. Our broccoli here has just come out of the oven. You can see it's nice and golden and roasted. Open up the salsa tray first. Sprinkle that all over everything. And I love lots of fresh lemon like that. Just sprinkle it over evenly. And then lastly, a little sprinkle of Parmesan cheese. And I like to finish with a bit of black pepper. Is it all right so these gorgeous pies have just come out of the oven now I would let them definitely sit for like a minute or two to cool down but I just wanted to show you a little trick for easy ways to unmold these to serve them if you actually just snip an edge of the foil um, container you can just basically peel it off and serve the hot pie 